Hi guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about two new collections launching from Calorisa Carol on September 1st. We have the fall collection, six pieces in this collection, and then we have the Halloween collection, which there are five pieces in that collection. So I'm super pumped to swatch these for you. We're going to go all right in a row. I'm going to start with fall, and then we're going to move on to the Halloween collection, and we're going to go in alphabetical order for everything, of course. The website for Calorsa Carol's polishes will be in the description bar below. Don't forget, with this brand, you can always get 10% off of your order using my discount code. That is just my name, so it's easy to remember. Just type my name into the discount code area, get 10% off. Easy as that. So, we're going to get to swatching you guys. Let's get right into it because we have 11 polishes to look at today. So this is the fall 2019 collection. Each polish is going to be $11.50 and you can get the whole thing, all six pieces for just $60. So that's an awesome savings. And we're gonna go in alphabetical order, which means we get to start with the polish called Hayride. And each of these bottles is 15 milliliters, by the way. Hayride is described as a copper medium brown with aurora shimmer, iridescent chameleon glitter, and ultra chameleon chrome flakes. That means the multi-chrome kind. I'm just going to be swatching everything at two coats for you today. So these are all fantastically pigmented, you guys, and reach total opacity for me at just two coats. My photos will be two coats as well, and they will also all have top coat on them. So the flakies that I'm seeing in here, the multi-chrome ones are this beautiful, rich, copper to gold coloration. The Aurora Shimmer looks to be maybe like a red gold green. Super, super pretty, you guys. Very fall feeling. This lovely kind of medium brown base with this um, soft coppery shimmer rolling all throughout. Just beautiful. So this is Hayride. Next up we have the purple, and this is kind of a blurple shade. Um, this one's called Lavender Tea. Lavender Tea is described as a dark lavender purple with aurora shimmer, rainbow crystal chameleon flakies. Those are the iridescent kind that you can kind of see your color through, and the multi-chrome flakes as well. The aurora shimmer has this beautiful strong pink gold green or red gold green. It's so, so pretty, you guys. Very, very strong. And then the flakies, the chameleon flakies, I'm getting blue, green, fuchsia. The multi-chrome flakies, I'm seeing, I think, some blue and green in there as well. Maybe a little bit of copper, gold. So, so fun. So, lavender tea, I got this nice and opaque at two coats as well. And finishing off with top coat. Next up, this one is a surprise. This is gorgeous. It's called Love and Lemons. And this one has a beautiful finish. It's this gorgeous kind of spring lime green. It's described as a bright shamrock green. It has shimmer, green to blue, and multi-chrome flakes, but off the top I'm getting this lovely warm pinky red glow as well, which I guess is coming from the um, multi-chrome flakes. Ooh, it's so, so bright, you guys. And then for sure at different angles you're getting the really strong blue-green glow from the Aurora Shimmer as well. This one was such a surprise. What she did in this bottle is so, so cool. If you love to collect greens, this one is a must have. I'm a total green fan myself, so I was obsessed with this one. Next up, we have the orange, you guys. This is a fierce burnt orange looking shade. It is called Picking Pumpkins. Picking Pumpkins is described as a brick orange. Mm, so yummy, just, you can just sink your teeth right into it with a shifty shimmer that's going from orange to green. Oh, this one is super, super pretty. The shimmer element on here is just slightly larger, so it's almost looking like a fleck, kind of. When I think of a fleck, I think of it's like between a shimmer and a flaky. It's not quite as big as a flaky, but they're really, really bright and they're really popping out against this real yum, warm brick orange. Mmm, so pretty, you guys. Love, love, love. Next we have this Divine Mustard shade. I love it when a brand does a mustard. And this, again, we have a combination of Aurora Shimmer and Multi-Chrome Flakies. This polish is called Scattered Leaves. And like I said, you have a mustard base. And the rest of the description reads, Mustard Yellow with Copper Shimmer and Violet to Pink to Gold Multi-Chrome Flakes. Ooh, they're so pretty. I'm actually getting green out of that multi-chrome flake as well. So it's like a violety, pinky, fuchsia kind of color and then gold and green. So beautiful. 
um, really, really packed with flakies as well, so you're getting a lot on the nail. And then you have this beautiful copper shimmer running all throughout the mustard. So it's warming up even more with that copper shimmer. Beautiful, you guys. Fantastically opaque in just two coats. These are really easy to play with. And the last polish in this collection is the beautiful deep red shades. It's a fall red, if I've ever seen a fall red, and this one's called Sweater Weather. Sweater Weather is described as a cranberry red with a subtle shimmer green to gold. Inside the red base though, I'm getting like a fuchsia pink to gold and then this beautiful strong green ripple. So it's got some really fun elements to it. This is a very pigmented cranberry shade. So it's going to get very opaque at just the two coats and it swatches so beautifully. Very buttery formula, just lovely. And then the shimmer is gonna be like your secret sauce. So that is the fall 2019 collection from Calorisa Carol launching on September 1st. Let's move along to the Halloween collection. This collection is called Halloween 2019. And each of these, as far as I can tell, is named after a woman from a famous Halloween or horror movie. So we're gonna go in alphabetical order again, of course. That means we get to start with Annabelle. And Annabelle is inspired by the doll from the Conjuring kind of world of horror films. Annabelle is described as a light gray crelly with copper shimmer and a copper hollow glitter blend and an orange hollow glitter blend. This one is really cool, you guys. I mean, an orange and a gray is just kind of eerie. It reminds me of Chris like October nights or Halloween night. It's really, really pretty, you guys. And this is a very soft kind of crelly gray that the glitters just sink right into. So the glitters in here, the copper and orange hollow glitters in a whole variety of sizes are very bright, beautiful, stunning, striking glitters. This is a really fun polish. Next up we have this purple kind of metallic hollow and this one's called Carrie. For the film Carrie and this one's described as a metallic holographic purple just like that this one is beautiful I was watching this on and I was just ooh, really in love with the fact that she added the metallic element to this holographic just made it really really striking I loved this it's perfectly opaque in just two coats so I think I've actually only seen one of the movies in this whole group here um, but I definitely know what all of these are referencing um, in any case, this is beautiful. I'm going to end up swatching the glitter bomb over top of this one as well later, so you'll see this later on. So this is Carrie, beautiful, beautiful metallic holographic shade. The next polish in the collection is the orange, you guys. This one is phenomenal. This has this gorgeous bright saturated orange shade with all of the Halloween colors thrown in. It's so, so fun. This one's called Clarice from Sounds of the Lambs. This is the only one that I have seen. Um, Clarice is described as an orange curly with green glitter, purple glitter, and iridescent flakes. And you're just getting so much green, orange, purple flashing on the nail, and it's packed. It's densely packed with glitter, you guys. This one is so cool. It has this gorgeous shimmer in it as well, so. Love, love, love. This is Clarice, and I did two coats. It gets totally opaque for a jelly polish. It's fantastic it's because it's so packed with components. Now the last two are going to be the white curly glitter and the glitter topper. They are essentially gonna have the same things in them, which is a wild, crazy amount of <laughs> black, purple, white, green, and orange glitters in them. They are really super fun. So we're gonna start out with the white curly. This one's called Dolores, and this was inspired by Dolores Claiborne, another one which I haven't seen, but it has a very epic Kathy Bates in it, so maybe I should see it, huh? You guys have to let me know. The ones that I haven't seen, tell me down in the comments below which ones are your, like, you must see this this Halloween. Okay, Dolores is described as a white crelly with white, green, orange, and purple glitters in various shapes and sizes, and it has black shreds. So there's so, so much going on in here. Some of the purple glitters are a little bit fuchsia. The orange glitters are neon. The white glitters are these kind of donut looking glitters that have little holes in the middle. They are super, super fun. And there is a very wide range of sizes and shapes going on here, you guys. This is just kind of like a Halloween glitter party in a white curly base. Now we'll move on to the topper. This pretty much has, like I said, the same things. Um, it maybe has even more. Love the glitter components. This is 
called Rosemary, inspired by Rosemary's Baby, which I also haven't seen, but you guys let me know. Let me know down in the comments. What do I need to watch? This is described as a clear base with white, green, orange, and purple glitters in various shapes and sizes and black shreds. So I topped it over an orange polish. You could put it over a white, black, purple. I mean, you could really put it over anything you want to, but if you want your look to be very Halloween, stick with one of the colors that's already in the um, glitter mix in here. Again, it has the same kind of thing, like a whole bunch of different glitter sizes, shapes, the neon glitters, the little kind of donut white glitters, the black shreds. So this one's super fun, very, very densely packed with glitter. And this one's called Rosemary. So that rounds out the collection, you guys. That is the Halloween 2019 collection. So I definitely encourage you to pick out a few that you like and support a small business. That would be fantastic. Thanks for being here for this review, you guys. I will see you back for another one very soon. Have a fantastic rest of your day and take care. Bye.